Once upon a time, in a land where meatballs rolled down hills and tomato sauce flowed like rivers, there lived a curious little girl named Isabella. She had a penchant for adventure and a love for all things pasta. Her favorite bedtime story was about the legendary flying spaghetti monster, a creature said to soar through the skies. Its noodly appendage is trailing behind like wispy clouds. Isabella's grandmother, Nana Maria, would tuck her into bed each night and regale her with tales of the flying spaghetti monster's escapades. According to Nana Maria, the monster had eyes made of olives, a meatball for a heart, and a sauce-stained apron draped over its saucy form. It would glide across the moon, sprinkling parmesan stardust and spreading marinara rainbows. One moonlit evening, Isabella couldn't contain her curiosity any longer. She tiptoed out of her cozy pasta-shaped bed, slept on her spaghetti strand slippers, and crept into the kitchen. There, she found an old, dusty cookbook, the very one Nana Maria used to conjure up magical pasta dishes. The recipe for summoning the flying spaghetti monster was written in flurry cursive. Boil a pot of water until it sings like an opera singer. Add spaghetti strands and stir clockwise while chanting. Pasta la vista, monster. Sprinkle grated cheese and crushed red pepper for extra flavor. Toss the pasta into the night sky and make a wish. Isabella followed the instructions with fervor. As the spaghetti strands twirled above her head, she closed her eyes and whispered, I wish to meet the flying spaghetti monster. Suddenly, a gust of warm wind swept through the kitchen, and the room filled with the aroma of garlic and basil. Isabella opened her eyes to find herself floating above the rooftops, held aloft by a tangle of spaghetti, and there, before her, was the most magnificent sight, the flying spaghetti monster itself. Its noodly appendages shimmered like al dente linguine and its meatball heart posed with marinara magic. The monster's olive eyes twinkled as it spoke in a sauce-splattered voice. Ah, little one, you've summoned me. What is your wish? Isabella's heart raced. She blurted out, I want to explore the pasta constellations and ride on your saucy back. The flying spaghetti monster chuckled, wrapping its noodles around her. Together, they soared through the night sky, leaving trails of parmesan stardust. Isabella giggled as they dipped and swirled, passing by the great ravioli nebula and the spaghettini comet. Tell me, said the monster, what do you love most about pasta? Isabella thought for a moment. I love how it brings people together, she replied. Sharing a plate of spaghetti with family and friends, it's like a warm hug. The monster nodded. And that, my dear, is the true magic of pasta. It binds hearts, just as sauce clings to noodles.